Short Squeeze. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in this video, I want us to talk about Bling Charging. So this is a company that provides our charging for electric vehicles. And I've covered this company a lot here on the channel and told you guys where I think the company falls in the space of um, electric vehicle charging and the potential of the company. But uh, in today's video, I want to talk about Blink Charging from a different perspective. So uh, just stay tuned and listen and watch the video all the way to the end because the information I have in here is something that can potentially benefit you if you don't already have a position in uh, Blink. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So guys, the reason I'm talking about Bling charging today is because Bling happened to be number two on the high short interest stock list. Uh, if you guys remember when GameStop was going through that craziness, I did a video here and showed you guys potential uh, short squeeze uh, stocks. And at that point, GameStop was number one on this list. Um, and so now when I look at the list again, I see Bling number two on the list. And again, this is a company that we've been covering here on the channel. And now if it's number two on the short squeeze uh, list, I don't know what that means. Uh, potentially, it can really explode and just make a lot of you guys money or nothing can happen. But I want to make sure that uh, we cover it. Again, um, if you, for those of you that don't understand what a short, uh, let's say the short interest is. So short interest definition and use case. Um, this is from uh, Investopedia. So if you go there, it says that short interest is the number of shares that have been sold uh, short, but have not yet been covered or closed out. So again, if you take a, a particular, let's say a particular stock, people that short it, um, they just short it and just let it sit. So shorting means that they sell the stock and hoping that the price will drop and then they'll buy it uh, at the bottom. And then the difference there is making profit. So you can either go long or you can go short. So go long, you buy low, say high. Go short, you say high, buy low and make profit. So that is what um, uh, short is all about. But short interest in this case for bling is very, very high. Uh, again, on this uh, website, high short interest stocks, they're only putting um, stocks that have a short interest of over 20%. So if you can see it right here, it has to be 20% to appear on this list. And bling happened to have a short interest of over 41%, close to about 42%. So that's almost like over like over 40% of the float is actually shorted. That is not usually a good sign, which most in most cases, people believe that the price is going to drop. But you, we've seen how the short squeezes usually happen, right? People start buying, and then the, the people that shorted the stock try to cover, and then it keeps pushing the price up and up and up, case in point, GameStop. So that is what I wanted to kind of bring this to your attention because Again, like I said, um, the stocks that appear on this list, let's look at where GameStop is currently uh, trading right now on this list or trending. GameStop is right here. So GameStop is not even in the top 20, um, maybe top 30. GameStop is completely at least out of the, the top five right now. So companies that I'm seeing here that is some companies that we've talked about on the channel again bling as number one that we've talked about here I see Fobu I see INO and those are all companies that we'll cover here on the channel and the short interest there is crazy if you look at Beyond Meat and uh, Workhorse so I can understand Workhorse uh, Beyond Meat maybe um, Fobu, um, Inovio, I mean, all these other companies, it doesn't mean that this is going to happen. It just means that a lot of people are thinking that this company is, the price is going to go down. And so they're shorting it for some potential profit. So, but we'll, we'll see how that happens. Again, if, uh, the folks on Reddit say this and decide to make Bling the next game stop, that would be awesome. And that's why I wanted to really talk about this because Bling is really sitting right now at a position where it can become the next GameStop. 
again, this is where uh, people get that information from uh, in terms of the high short interest. So um, again, let me know, guys, what do you think about is Bling being on this list? And if we go here, the news that um, Bling was actually trading um, at about 13% higher for the day. And the reason is because it said uh, Bling is one of the most heavily shorted stock with over 40% of its float shorted. So that's why Bling made that move. There wasn't any significant reason why Bling should be trading higher. So you see, there's an opportunity there that people can actually make money. So if we take a look here, so this is, if we just go back five days. So look at this. So um, April 8th, look at Bling open up at about 42 and squeeze all the way to about uh, 46 uh, before pulling back again. So if you see the high there was uh, 46.30 and then before we'll start pulling back. So again, there's a possibility that this can still uh, squeeze up next week if Bling continue to be on this naughty list. Uh, which, um, again, we've seen stocks that have been on this list just um, go parabolic and make people a lot of money. And some people lost a ton of money in those parabolic moves too. So, um, yeah, that's what I wanted to cover in this video. Again, if you don't know what Bling does, they do uh, provide electric uh, vehicle charging stations. Um, they're building these charging stations across the country, and that's their business model. So you see them at like your apartment complex, your grocery store, or maybe a ball pack or any place where people pack vehicles and, and, and go about their business, you would see these charging stations there. So that's why uh, I wanna make sure you guys are, are aware of this. So yeah, let me know in the comment section what you think about this. If you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. If that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell too, you don't miss out or new content. Also, if you are looking to get started with investing, Webo has their promotion where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get some free stocks. Links in the description below. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated.